Good morning, Barons. I'm Silas with your daily announcements for Monday, September 19th. Let's see what announcements we have for today. Attention students, Barron Buddies is now accepting applications for 10th to 12th graders. If you are interested in joining Barron Buddies and becoming a positive role model for an elementary student, please be sure to check your email for the Barron Buddies application. Applications are due Friday, September 23rd. For questions, please contact Mrs. Scheiber in the guidance office. Jostin's representatives will be at DeKalb High School on Wednesday, September 21st to take class jewelry order forms during lunch in the cafeteria. Design your jewelry online, bring your order form along with your $50 deposit, and you will receive a free hoodie. Jostin's will be back on Thursday, September 22nd to take orders for se seniors cap, gown, and tassel units and graduation products. Don't forget your order form and the $80 down payment. Check out all the Jostin's products and class jewelry at jostins.com. DeKalb Barons are invited to attend the first annual See You at the Pole event, Wednesday, September 28th. Come to the flagpole in front of door number one to pray with other students for our school, our city, and our nation. The event will last from 8.15 to 9 a.m. You do not need to stay the entire time. You can attend for a short time or the entire event. If you have any questions, feel free to contact Kate Bender or Ian Young. Fair forms are ready for pickup in the security office. Forms are to be filled out and returned to the security office no later than Thursday, September 22nd. No late forms will be accepted. The annual Powder Puff football game will be played on Friday, September 23rd during the school day. Any junior or senior wanting to participate in the game should pick up an application in the main office beginning today. Space for players, coaches, and cheerleaders is limited and will be managed on a first-come, first-served basis, determined by the date of the application being turned into the main office. All forms must be turned in no later than today. Specific information regarding participation is included on the application in the office. If you have any questions, please see Mr. Wagner. During the homecoming bonfire this Thursday night, the DHS student government will be holding a cornhole fundraising tournament for construction. Sign-ups are being held during lunch until Tuesday. The entry is $10 per team. The Cal JV football beat Columbia City 36-6 Saturday at Columbia City. Trevor Meyer caught three touchdown passes, including a 96-yarder. Kyle Dunham threw two touchdown passes and Peyton Stout threw one and rushed for another. Cole Althouse had a touchdown run as well. Two-point conversions were scored by Dunham, Althouse, and Landon Miller. The Barons will travel to Huntington North next Saturday. Girls Golf placed second at the sectional on Saturday. Lexi Stuckey led the Barons with an 80 and placed third individually. Following was Allie Stuckey placing seventh, Bailey Stuckey placing 10th, Sarah Williams placing 15th, and Marie Burton placing 25th. For lunch today, we'll have chicken patty, flat out sub, and carbonara. Tomorrow for lunch, we'll have beef Manhattan, chicken nuggets, barbecue riblet, and chicken parmesan sub. Happy birthday today to Michaela Cooper, Topanga Hine, and Landon Miller. That's all the announcements for today, Barons. I'm Silas. Have a